Chapter 135 Thousands of meters under the ocean, in a vast and dark space, an ancient tomb with a stone cross is emitting a faint, mysterious sky-blue light, with bubbles still gently rising around this tomb. A pair of huge eyes are looking at the tomb with utmost reverence. It is the giant mutated whale. This is the tomb of the prophet of the sea race, who led all marine creatures onto the first path of evolution, and since then, the various sea races have developed crazily, achieving great power, and can now be regarded as standing at the top of the earth. The mutated whale silently bowed its head in reverence once more, then it swung its huge tail and left. At Misty Mountain, under the full sunlight, the canopy of the divine tree is rustling in the wind, right at the top of the divine tree, an ice flower has sprouted. The divine tree knew about this, because he had absorbed too many ice spirit stones and had condensed into a divine flower. He was a little embarrassed and didn't know who to give this precious flower to. He had to check the KPI of his subordinates this month. This flower might make the person who absorbs it evolve up a level. It really is a priceless flower. While thinking deeply, the voice of the nine-tailed fox rang out softly, Master, since you can freely change your shape to become gigantic, should we expand our borders outward? Hearing this, the divine tree squinted his eyes and said, Expand further. Definitely, I will definitely expand the land, but not now. It must be so, anyway, he doesn't have the mood to talk about these future things. Yesterday he killed a transcendent fourth order with the strength of a fifth order, but didn't get any encouragement from the system, and this system guy even came and threatened him. It's really too insecure. The divine flower with the appearance of a small fairy flew over and asked, Divine tree, can I follow you? The divine tree happily said, Of course, with you by my side, my cultivation speed also increases very quickly. But while they were talking, a noisy sound interrupted them. The two of them looked down, only to see the panda sticking his hand in his pocket. One hand holding a phone to his ear and talking. His voice was like a radio. He was very talkative. This guy is calling Xiao Ai, reporting that he has arrived. Oh, just like a boyfriend reporting to his girlfriend. And then they will ask each other if they have eaten, bathed. Just like the content that the panda is talking about, then... The panda took a picture to report to Xiao Ai and made everyone behind him take a selfie with him. The divine flower was embarrassed and covered her face with her hand. Looking at the figure of the panda who was busy talking and walking away, the divine tree whispered, This kid is getting weirder and weirder. The elder nine tails scolded, The more I look at this guy, the more I hate him. The divine flower was jealous and complicated in her heart so she didn't say anything only her eyes lit up with a sharp light. The system announced that the ice flower on the head of the divine tree has fully matured, the divine tree is very happy, and let out a cheer. Then, the divine tree decided to call the deserving member to receive this super precious gift. He shouted, White! The white tiger immediately roared in response, his eyes very determined as he stood on a rock, his wings also spread out ready to receive orders from the divine tree. How majestic and powerful! Oh, but the divine tree grabbed the white tiger and threw it aside, saying, No, not calling you. That's right, it was calling the white snake. The white snake was also very agile, had crawled to the foot of the divine tree waiting for orders. The divine tree generously handed out the ice flower and said, Eat this flower. The white snake's eyes lit up with joy. She didn't expect the master to let her eat something so precious. She had only heard others tell about it, never tasted it. But the white snake knew that this is a super priceless thing in this world. Not saying much, Mao Tse's hand does. The white snake thanked the divine tree while biting the ice flower. Immediately a terrifying energy burst out around. But when she swallowed it into her stomach, her whole body immediately lit up. All the cells of the white snake were filled with extremely pure and concentrated ice energy. The divine tree also had to use a branch to cover its eyes, too bright. Digestion completed, the white snake successfully evolved, still a pure white skin, but the white snake now has an additional sky-blue flame mane that looks very cool, the size of the body has also grown a lot. The face of the white snake has become even more beautiful, a beauty of maturity and wisdom. The divine tree also exclaimed, so beautiful, when he looked into the turquoise eyes of the white snake. Then the white snake tried a new skill which is riding the wind and breaking the waves that allows her to fly in the air. 
This is the small divine skill that she just learned after evolving, but the speed of this skill is very special, fast as light, yes, moving in the air with the skill riding the wind and breaking the waves will achieve the speed of light, isn't it terrifying? But the divine tree suddenly felt a slight jealousy. Other creatures can fly as soon as they level up, but the divine tree can't. This makes him feel very unfair. The wild boar, the orange-haired monkey, and the bear looked at this, all with wide eyes in admiration, knowing how to fly is really a miracle, and it is a noble level, except for the master, who doesn't need to fly but is always noble. The white snake turned back and rubbed her head against the divine tree. Her voice softly said in embarrassment, Master, I will always love you. Hearing this, the divine tree was also a little embarrassed, laughed haha and said, Let me check your attribute table. The attribute table appeared, Elemental Dragon, Transcendent Second Order, Innate Talent, Manipulate Ice, Absolute Ice Manipulation, Freeze Everything with Breath, Second Innate Talent, Manipulate Cold Electricity, Navigate Cold Electricity, Skill Elemental Incarnation, Create Ice Armor that can significantly increase defensive power, Dragon Body, with the body of a dragon. Significantly superior to all other species in all stats, Absolute Freeze can freeze everything, Small Divine Skill. Riding the wind and breaking the waves helps increase movement speed equal to light. After reading the white snake's attribute table, the divine tree was completely stunned for a while. Too powerful. This girl has two innate talents, and many rich skills. Both attack and defense are enough. If carefully cultivated, she will definitely be a powerful factor in Misty Mountain. The divine tree loudly said, White snake, you must diligently cultivate. There will be a day when you become a dragon. Hearing this, the white snake suddenly raised her head and looked at the divine tree with determined eyes. The dragon is the strongest creature in the world. Its existence is always compared to the gods. If the white snake becomes a dragon, this will not only improve the combat power of Misty Mountain but also cause a strong shock on the earth. The divine tree continued then, you will be the strongest person in Misty Mountain. The white snake happily nodded. A bright smile appeared. Time quietly passed and it has been a month since the divine tree defeated Australith. Ching Kong and the white bear were sent to the northern border for defense. While the divine tree was stationed at Misty Mountain, eight days later, on the Australian continent, another incident that shocked the world occurred, with the land itself being the world's activation stone area so now it has become a paradise for mutant beasts, also the most dangerous place in the world right now. In the sky of this land, suddenly a huge black tornado appeared, from inside. Countless dazzling lightning strikes out. The sound is not like the sky being torn apart, but the sky is really torn apart. Thousands of meters long lightning strikes hit the ground, and from here, the first dragon appeared. A legendary creature, the first transcendent third order dragon appeared in the world. Its whole body is covered with extremely thick black scales, the true image of the European dragon, very muscular. Its roar is very loud, tens of kilometers away can still be heard. Its body is as big as a mountain, wings tens of meters long, can create a storm equivalent to level 12. The reaction was very quick. The Spirit Investigation Bureau sent an excellent team to investigate. Of course they were awarded the title of Heroic Martyr first, because the result of this investigation everyone knows, that is they will all die. These brave guys saw the mutated dragon, sweat pouring out, their faces turned pale with fear and the first footage was returned to headquarters. Soon after, the Free Federation, the Chinese Federation, the Luo Kingdom, and the Ten Nation Alliance all received the news. China Alliance, the Free Federation, the Chinese Federation, the Luo Kingdom, and the whole world was once again in crisis. On the screen, a large muscular black dragon is proudly perched on a rock, looking into the distance. This is the precious film that the reconnaissance team has sent back. An important meeting has been opened. They began to discuss this creature. This is a huge dragon. Moreover, it is the evil dragon in the legend. Yes, all black dragons are evil dragons. Our ancestors taught so. A senior manager, with a worried face full of worry, said this legendary creature, has it appeared in the world? A bald professor went to the screen and calmly said, This one has not fully evolved yet. Look, its wings are not yet complete. It is only a sub-dragon level dragon species. Saying this, the professor seemed too calm, making some senior figures feel unhappy. They doubted and said, 
Now that there is this dangerous species, you say, what is the difference between a sub-dragon and a dragon? The bald professor still calmly said, in terms of strength, the dragon is considered mature, the strength is fully erupted, while this one is a sub-dragon, it can only exert a part of the dragon's strength. Everyone sweated coldly, the sub-dragon is already a third order, and it is only considered to exert a part of the dragon's strength. The professor continued, so we need to quickly destroy it before it fully evolves and matures, otherwise, this war will be more terrifying than the war of the mutant tree in Australith. The bald professor's face showed danger and greed, he continued, if we get the body of this dragon, it will be a leap forward for human research. And so, not only to prevent the risk of danger to humans, but also the value of this is very high, therefore, destroying the dragon is an act that humans must do. At Misty Mountain, Aki just brought the secret report to Divine Tree. It was Shaoling who sent the message, but the words were too small and Divine Tree's eyes were poor and had to use a magnifying glass to look. It is the announcement of the first appearance of the dragon species on earth. Shaoling has also been summoned to discuss this matter. According to Divine Tree's guess, the countries will unite and deal with this matter together, because no one wants to bear the loss alone. Although feeling that this matter has little to do with him, Divine Tree still carefully arranged manpower to take care of this matter. Of course, it is not for fun, Divine Tree really wants a sub-dragon to join the Misty Mountain faction. Here, Shaoling's reconnaissance team is ready. They stand upright waiting for the order to board the helicopter. Behind, Shaoling is thinking about something, or waiting for Divine Tree's order, deciding whether to get involved in this matter or not. End of chapter 135